Hey y'all, welcome back. Today I am burning pumpkin coconut in a kind of an older candle, I guess. It's from 2016. So I was, I woke up this morning and started watching Tina Delicious Kent, his video about just, I, I, it was about lots of different things, but it was, he hauled some candles, okay, after, it's been a while, so he did haul some of the new candles, and it seemed that there was like three candles that had coconut in them, and it just really got me in the mood for coconut, kind of, not just like tropical summery coconut, but like a kind of a bakery coconut. And so I was like, you know what? I'm going to burn pumpkin coconut. I haven't burned that in a long time. I just hold on to the thing. And I'm afraid, this is one of the things that Kent talked about in his video, that I'm afraid that the candle is going to start, is going to go bad. It's three years old, over three years old. So, um, yeah, I'm, I'm burning it. Yay. So let me just tell you about this, a little bit of, about this candle in case you don't know the scent notes. And I don't know if this has come out recently, but it's spiced pumpkin, toasted coconut, creamy vanilla, and sea salted caramel. I mean, it's, it's old enough to where it doesn't have the and essential oils added in on the label. So, <laughs> I mean, nowadays everything has essential oils in it. But yeah, I this is one of my very favorite of the season when I when I got it myself. Um, I guess three years ago, and it was strong. That's what I remember. I ordered this is this is. A second one. I, I went through one or two actually. This is my the last one of this one. And I just it was just a, such a night. I just love it. It's just a comfort set. Now they did come out with a coconut one. Um what is it? Coconut macaron, which is kind of similar to it, I think, from this year. I forgot about that one. I forgot I had that one. Yay! Okay, so they're kind of similar. So, like, if I get when I get done with this one, then I've got that one, or I can switch between the two. So that's fine. But yeah, I just I know that I wanted this candle. I wanted to get more of them because it was so deliciously strong. <laughs> it's a great scent. So I decided I'm just gonna start. Like I said, when I'm in the mood for something, I'm going to try to see if I've got something that will kind of before I run out and try to buy anything. Now I can't go buy those candles that um, Kent was talking about in his video because um, I don't think they're out yet. First of all, that toasted coconut s'mores one. Holy cow, I that one sounds so good to me and I really, really want it and I feel like if it comes into the stores that I will get it. But you know, and then I was like, gosh, I wish I could find it. I know my mom is going to be near a test store today. I actually told her to look and see if they had them. And, you know, if she ends up giving me one, then that's great. But I'm not going to buy them off of Mercari or anything this, this time. I have done it in the past, but I'm not going to this time. So that's a step in the right direction, I guess. Oh, I hope that it comes out, though, because then I'll be like, oh, I missed out on that candle. Oh, well. I don't think anything could beat this one, so I'm just going to enjoy it. Pumpkin coconut. So let me know if you have burned this one or chopped it up and melted it or experienced this candle anyway. Let me know down in the comments what you think about it and if it's one of your favorites like it is one of my favorites. All right, see y'all in the next video. Bye y'all.